what we are developing at Norma is we have developed a hybrid technology that puts together a supercapacitor, which is an energy storage device, and CO2 capture. Our technology can capture CO2 from the atmosphere and by separating, so absorbing and desorbing CO2, at the same time, we are reusing the energy that we are inputting in the process. The concept of the device itself resembles very much the one of a supercapacitor. What is leveraged in a supercapacitor is what is called electrostatics. So ions moving. We are able to move ions in our device and by moving ions we are actually charging our supercapacitors. Is it moving the ion part of the result of carbon capture? Exactly. That's where the connection happens. Yes. So it's basically like you have a special type of battery from this magic vacuum machine. Every single time you find that one in a million people you get a reboot of your battery. Every time we find the, the CO2, so one of those 422 people, our vacuum cleaner is very, very happy and continues going on with the energy that already has. This is an uh, exceptional female scientist who the people that I admire the most, and she is going to receive an award on this Friday, which is? <laughs> it's a Global Women um, Inventor and Innovator Award. That's what makes me hopeful, okay? <laughs> a girl with a little bit of creativity meets climate change. So what are we going to do about it, right? Yeah, we need to solve it. <laughs> You're listening to Bite Size Climate Tech, Season 4. Let's dive in. Time to make climate cool again.